Hey, what's up, guys? My name is Praetorian, and welcome back to Heart to Bomb 4s. We are playing with the Turkish Social Republic in the Road to 56 mod. Uh, so sorry that this video is going to be so late. Um, I had to do my taxes here on Saturday. I had to get it done because uh, the I think the, the the government starts accepting taxes is this Monday. Uh, so I really wanted to get it done, and uh, fortunately it took way longer than I expected. I'm actually rather depressed about the taxes, so I really need some gaming in my life right now uh, because we got back a lot less than we were expecting, like thousands, thousands less than we were expecting. So that's, uh, I'll tell you right now, 2018 is already looking like it's going to be another rough year. But anyways, let's go ahead and get started, guys. So you're probably going to notice that the video is really, really long today, uh, in addition to being late. Well, that's because I decided to do something different because this video was going to be so late. I mean, I might have been able to get it out by, I don't know, maybe 9, 9 p.m. or something like that on Saturday night, uh, you know, and recorded two videos, one for Saturday and then one for Sunday. But if I had done that, then I would have had to put the Sunday video out really late as well because uh, you kind of got to leave a video out, for, you know, somewhere close to 24 hours, you know, maybe a little bit less, uh, or else it, it doesn't have enough time to get watched and people would just skip to the next video, which... You know, it's kind of odd to me, but whatever. That's that's how they they often do it. So then it feels like you kind of wasted the time recording it. So what I'm going to do instead is I'm just going to record a long, uh, very long episode, uh, and then I'm going to release it. It's going to be obviously later because it takes longer uh, to do everything when you have a, a video that you know passes one hour. You know, longer editing, longer rendering, longer uploading, processing, and then even longer to go HD. Uh, so so yeah, that's the way I'm going to do it. So it's going to be out probably really early in the morning on Sunday before I go to bed. And yeah, I think it's going to be better to do it this way. Uh, you get overall, you get, you know, more content earlier in a sense. Uh, plus this is one less intro. So <laughs> that also takes time. Uh, so let's go ahead and get started guys. Um, last episode, we, uh, we're cleaning up the Balkans. We are almost done here. Um, yeah, there's not much left to be done over here, uh, in the North Africa theater doing pretty well over here as well. Troops really advancing. Uh, we also have some issues over here, which we're gonna have to move our troops over here to, um, defend against this. Uh, but we're not gonna do it yet. We're gonna wait. Uh, we're gonna use these Balkan troops for that. Uh, over here in the Asia theater, things are going nicely as well. I reduced this frontier, uh, because we're gonna attempt to cut these divisions off here. In fact, let's go ahead and fix this now because this whole front is kind of odd. We're just gonna give them a new one. I think that'd be the better way of doing this. Um, let's do, Okay, I kind of want them to go along this way here, um, like this. I know this is going to kind of get a little bit messed up, but it's okay. Uh, so just like that, um, you know, we're not even ordering them. This is the one front that we're kind of controlling them because, yeah, I think it's better that way for this front. Uh, the other fronts, we kind of have the AI in control, except for the Balkans. We're controlling that one as well, and that's why things aren't go are going so slowly. Um, so we're taking this here. Everything's looking good. I just want to make sure that this front is is moving as quickly as it can. Let's take a look at France. Um, see when they're going to capitulate. They are currently 91%. Uh, okay, awesome. So we are getting it done over there, guys. Uh, let's go ahead and let this uh, game play out. Uh, as you can see, the China theater here. We're about to get these troops here cut off from supply uh, momentarily. If we take that province right there, I believe. Uh, so we're probably going to want to attempt to do that. We got a lot of troops leaving here. Um, let's see if. Uh, hmm. Let's, okay, let's bring this guy, let's bring this guy here, this guy here, and this guy here, and see how that works out. Looks like all of those are going to be losses. Oh, well, that's unfortunate. Let's go ahead and pull all those back then. Uh, clearly, that none of that's going to work. Um, yeah, that sucks. We need a few more divisions in these areas, I think, to really get it done. Well, that tank came in, and they, they took that province, so that's nice. Uh, so we should be able to get a little bit more support over here. We're also getting this unit here. All the units that are coming over here from the north are going to help us out. All right, let's take a look at the situation here, because overall, this is kind of a fucked up situation. Uh, these guys do have supply, but I think we should be able to get them wrapped up momentarily. Um, when do we have another division coming over here? Yeah, this guy is, but he can stay here. Let him do what he's doing. That's okay. All right, so this tank unit, let's go ahead and have him take that province. Uh, we're going to have this guy here. He can, yeah, he's already going over there. Awesome. Uh, and we have them all bottled up into two provinces here. Well, we're about to take that one. Uh, you guys can actually go ahead and stay here. Uh, and why don't you go this way? Excellent. Uh, so let's attack here. Oops, my bad. I thought I had them selected. Apparently I did not. Let's attack here and try and get these guys wrapped up over here. Uh, we're going to have these guys come across this way. It looks like he's having some difficulty there. I think he may be getting a river penalty. Let me just take a look here. He is getting a river penalty. All right, well, that's unfortunate. Let's go and pull him back then. Uh, and you guys come on over here. And yes, this is looking good. All right, so we should be able to get these all wrapped up very soon. Um, let's attack there. And hopefully nobody else is assigned over here. 
Uh, I can't tell. No, it looks like we're good. Uh, we should be able to take this province here momentarily. Go ahead and attack with the tank in it as well. Try and wrap it up quicker. And then we'll be able to get all these troops down into these two areas. We also have this here. Um, looks like we've taken this port. Let's go ahead and get these guys cut off. Or attempt to, anyway. Um, yeah, they're going to back into this province. That's good. Excellent. Uh, got some more convoys destroyed. So we're about to get all of uh, Greece into our hands. Uh, we do need to come back and take this one here. Uh, yeah, we need to take a couple provinces. That's okay. We'll get it wrapped up here momentarily. Let's just take a look. More convoys sunk. Excellent. Okay. Um, all right. I don't know uh, where all the um, allied fleet is. Not sure where they're at. Uh, but yeah, the uh, looks like the Russians will get Sicily. Uh, they'll get that into their hands. One, one person asked if we could ask the Soviets for some land. Um, maybe. You'd think we'd be able to get control of something. Uh, let me just see what... Let me take a look and see what they even have uh, first. All right, I wonder if we can get this in our hands. That would be nice. Let's see if they'll give us that. Probably not, even though, yeah, because that's considered... I wonder if, like, because we did all the work over here. Oops, that's not. Nope, <laughs> my bad. Um, we did all the work over here in France, so... No. Yeah, they're still kind of considering... I don't know if it's because of the two wars. Because um, they should give us... Let me see here. What do we have? We have four, five dockyards. So it wasn't the, like, cruiser that we built. Hmm. Okay, let's put that in there. And we're just going to put these into convoys for right now until we get those destroyers upgraded. Uh, yeah, I want to wait on that. Uh, nothing here. Uh, we do have some free military factories as well. Two free military factories. Let's get those assigned. We're going to put them into... Let's just take a look at the situation. Artillery is lacking. Uh, light tanks is a little bit low as well. Um, I think we want to put those... Yeah, we'll put it into that. Uh, let me just take a look at light tanks. Where are we at? Oh, we're already, already building out a lot of light tanks. All right, let's go into artillery then. Could use some more of those. Uh, and the outdated equipment is the cruisers. All right, did we build anything else yet? No, not yet. All right, so let's... Oh, yes, that's something I wanted to do. I feel like we need more cavalry units. We just don't have enough, guys. Um, let's go with five more of those, and then we're going to get some of these uh, reserve guys to hold little minor fronts as well. Um, and I think that'll be good. Five and five. Yeah, that looks good. Uh, let's have them going into Ankara. And well, hopefully that'll be good. We'll just have to see. Um, let's just take a look at this whole situation here. Maybe we don't need... Let me see here. Maybe we don't need as many as these guys. Um, I just want them to cover ports mainly. So I think three would probably be enough. And that would allow us to get more cavalry units. Yeah, let's do that. I think we need more of those uh, because they're the ones that are really good at holding provinces. Uh, so we have reached over to here. So let's go ahead and fix this, this blue army, make sure that they're continuing to attack. Uh, we want them to attack all along here. And let's just go ahead and have them execute that. Uh, start attacking now. Uh, and yes, we need to go back to Asia to take a look at the situation there. Um, eventually, we're going to get our fleet large enough where we're going to attempt an invasion of the... Uh, ooh, what happened here? Damn it. It got wider. Shit. Yeah, they're losing territory over here. That's unfortunate. All right, is there any way that we can take some more territory? Maybe attack right there? Yeah, I think it might be what we want to do. We can also attempt an attack here and see if we can get a win there if we support with these troops. Huh, yeah, that's surprising. I'm very surprised to see us not winning there. What if we send this uh, troop over there? The Japanese troops are so good. Um, also, you got to remember, guys, uh, which is kind of easy to forget, is the fact that we are... Can we attack here with these guys? Yes, we can. Uh, is the fact that we do have the difficulty turned up quite a bit for every country in the world. Uh, we got everybody turned up two notches. So, so yeah, we are facing, you know, guys that are, are better than us overall. Um, I wonder, should we just go ahead and take that? I guess we can. I'm a little bit worried about them not having enough troops over here. But it's fine. Let's just go. Just make it happen, guys. We are winning there, so uh, hopefully we can get them cut off. I want all these troops here cut off from supply. That would be awesome. That would be fantastic. I wonder if we can win here. No. Just go ahead and stop whatever you're doing. Stop it. Stop. There we go. Yeah, that's not going to work. Uh, let's go ahead and swing on back over to uh, these fronts here. I want to take a look at the French front, see how things are going. Uh, looks like we're mostly losing. Uh, so um, let me see. I kind of want to concentrate. Let's... Let's decrease the size of the front because clearly we can't can't defend all of this. Uh, so let's decrease the size of the front and instead attempt to focus on the north here. Uh, see if we can 
get some more provinces there so we can get the French um, capitulated. That would be incredibly helpful. What about the situation over here? Uh, we're not doing anything. I completely neglected this. All right, so what we're going to do is we're going to send this tank unit over here because he's a little bit quicker. Uh, these guys can take the railroads over to here. Um, and then we'll send this guy here to take that province. And then these, all these guys here are going to attack there. They've been cut off for a while now since we have been just kind of sitting this and letting this uh, sit here and nothing happen with it. Uh, these guys should be enough to take it, take care of it. Let me take a look at the situation over here. How bad is it getting? It's getting pretty bad. Uh, we're going to need to bring some guys over there soon. Stat. Um, I almost think, you know what? Let's go ahead and do it. Let's go ahead and get these guys going now. Anybody who's currently not, not doing anything. So you guys... You guys, all, all of them are going to be coming over here uh, to cover this front here. Um, we're just going to have them cover the entire front, I guess. Yep, come on over there. Um, assign. And then let's uh, give them an objective uh, to take take all of this. Um, I want them to take everything, if possible. All of this territory. I believe we're at war with all these countries here. I could be wrong, uh, but we'll check here in a minute. Just go like so. All right, that looks good. It does look like it got messed up some. Um, yeah, I got a little bit messed up. All right, well, that's unfortunate. Uh, we'll fix it later. It's fine. They got to get down there anyways, so it's going to take them a bit of time. I believe we are at war with them. Oh, we're not at war with them. That's what fucked it up. Got it. All right, well, now that I know that and I know what the issue is, uh, but we are at war with Yemen, right? Yes. Okay, so that's what the issue was. Uh, let's just fix it. All right, pull this back and pull it up like, like so. Just like this. It's going to look gorgeous. All right, there we go. Still fucked up. <laughs> Whatever, guys. Whatever. Let's just let them get over there. How is our blue army doing on their advancement? And we do have a bit of lag. I don't know what happened here. Somebody capitulate? Nope, not really. Uh, not entirely sure what happened there. And our blue army did get all fucked up, of course. Always, this whole front here has just been problems, man. Problems. All right, let's uh, get them going over here, please. Come on, there we go. Uh, and just attack, execute it, please. Get it done. All right, uh, we're also gonna have, instead of that tank unit going that way, why don't you guys come on over this way? And you guys can come that way. All right, excellent. Let's go and swing on back over to Asia, uh, since we're manually controlling that front as well. So we wanna make sure that everything is going nicely over here. Uh, looks like we did advance there. We're being attacked here though, so that's unfortunate. Maybe we can get these troops here uh, cut off. I don't know, that's pretty deep province right there. There's there's a lot of troops there. Um, we really extend the front just a little bit too much, unfortunately. Uh, what we're gonna do is let's just bring it back some so we don't have to defend as much, I think. I think that'd be the best option. Uh, and then we're gonna attack. Can we win? That is a fortified province. Probably don't wanna attack there. Let's go and bring these guys over this way. Uh, and we're gonna see if we can get a win here. That guy's pretty weak, so maybe. Um, this other guy's full strength, though, so yeah, it could end up being a loss. It is a green. All right, excellent. Um, so did we ever get another airbase over here? We did, but it's fully stacked. All right, we need another airbase, guys, and I don't have control of any of this territory, so they're not going to give it to me either. Damn it. Yeah, the problem over on that side of things is we don't have the air bases. Also, uh, one reason why we might be having issues here is because we haven't moved our plane jet. Uh, all of our planes are assigned further back, so I don't know if they're... It looks like they're still giving coverage, but let's get them a little bit closer anyways. Uh, let's see what we can do here. Um, this has a little bit of room, so what we'll do is we'll move... Oh, does it have enough for 600? No, it does not. All right, let's just move these two over there then. And then we can move the other fighter wing right there. All right, excellent. Uh, and then we're going to bring uh, this dive bomber wing. He can come on over here. And then these guys here can go, oh, let's put them over, over here as well. They can fit. And then these guys are going to be covering southern France for us. All right. Lovely. Yeah, that's looking good, guys. I like it. I like it a lot. Um, let's just take a look at some of the other situations around here. Uh, see where else we might need to provide a little bit more support. Uh, I think we're done here in the Balkans now. We are, so we can go ahead and move those planes. Um, let me see. Okay, we got these guys as well. They need to move. Uh, they'll move over here and provide support in North Africa, and then we can move uh, the planes that are here over to... God, it's all stacked. All right, that's unfortunate, but we're going to move them there. We, what we can do, move the fighters over here to cover our Arabia, and the dive bombers here. There we go. Uh, the fighters have a bit longer range, so that's the reason why we did that. Uh, we also have... 
Oh, Lord. We have some Nora over here as well. All right, let's go ahead and move these guys, too. We're going to put them into... Oh, put them into this one. Hope that the the close air support are, are going to be able to support. I don't know how much support they'll be able to provide, though. We're getting more troops over here. Um, and hopefully they don't advance any further before then. Uh, we'll just have to see. Uh, these guys are continuing to advance, doing well, I guess. Well, kind of. Uh, why don't you guys go this way? Go up here. I don't know why they always feel the need to do stupid things. Like, cut these troops off. Come on, help me out here. We don't have to fight them all the way across that territory. It looks like we already defeated them there. So what we want to do... That's my bad. Um, let me see here. I want you guys to go like so. Go that way. And then these guys here are going to go over there. All right, excellent. Just get them you know, manually controlled a bit since they're doing stupid stuff on their own. We are auto-saving because we're entering into the month of June here. Uh, we did win there. That is good to see. Uh, when do we get there? Oh, it's going to be a while. Damn it. That means we're going to have to fight somebody else. All right, that is what it is. Uh, unless we attack them here. We can do that. Let's attack right there, and then we're going to support with these troops here, and then maybe we can beat them so that we can get these troops cut off in two separate locations here. All right, that is actually fantastic. Um, damn, these guys are too weak to, to launch an attack over that way. All right, what we'll do, let's have these guys come on over here, and they'll launch the attack. And then you will cover right there. All right, that's looking good. Anywhere else where we might be able to make a little bit of movement? There is some openings here, but man, we are sure stretching the front a bit, aren't we? All right, well, let's attempt to go this way, and then we're going to attempt to attack over here and see if we can get this, uh, these two divisions here cut off. Let's just see if we can do it, uh, make it happen. Uh, anything else we need to be aware of? It looks like we're short on resources, a lot of steel. Oh, yes, that's right. I never did fix all this situation last episode. Okay, um, we're trading for too much rubber. Let's pull that back then. Uh, also the tungsten and we can pull that back too. So we'll do that uh, And then the steel let's get more steel from the Soviets uh, Yeah, there we go looking good uh, Everything else is good all along here. Uh, hopefully these guys will get there um, Before anybody else can it looks like we're gonna win there. Um, so yeah, we're gonna cut uh, these troops off here in the north now getting them destroyed is gonna be the difficult part guys uh, getting them all wiped out They'll be cut off from supply, but that's that's not gonna be enough. You still gotta still gotta wrap them up and then ensure that they don't break through here. Um, I don't know how we're gonna do that without uh, support from our allies. Yeah, the, the game is definitely getting laggy. Um, I've noticed, and somebody was commenting about that uh, in a previous episode that you know as we get later in the game, uh, we're gonna start seeing more and more issues with the lag. Where is the fucking orange army, man? Are they all taking railroads? They are. Okay, did we take all the Balkans over before we before they get too far? Yes. Yes, we are looking good here. All the Balkans are in our control. Okay, I'm very, very pleased with that. Hopefully the Soviets will get Sicily under their control as well. Uh, and then this will be our sea. Yep, as France falls to us, and well, it'll just be Spain, because we'll have North Africa in our hands too. Mediterranean will be uh, our sea. Let me see here. Um, any other... It doesn't look like we have sunk any of these, unfortunately. All right, maybe somebody here? Nah, just bombed them. All right, well, we're doing we're doing damage to convoys, um, and we did get our destroyers. Excellent. Um, how far are we on the destroyers? Uh, okay, we are in 1944. I think we're going to start building those. We'll go ahead and research the next model, I think. Let me just double check here if there's... Okay, the light cruiser model is 19... Ni excuse me, 1948. Yeah, let's go ahead and do the next line of uh, destroyers, and we'll start building some... Some of the uh, newer destroyers now. Because uh, we do have quite a bit of dockyards. Uh, let's just go and pull some of these back. Um, yeah, let's let's go ahead and build uh, some destroyers here. Destroyer threes. Uh, we're going to take these guys up here. No, they can stay under the light cruisers. Uh, we're going to pull from the convoys a bit. Seems like, yeah, we have a lot going towards convoys. Uh, and then let me just see how much pulling this back is going to affect it. Let's just let them finish that, and then we'll assign them. Uh, we do actually have one more dockyard, so let's go and get that assigned. All right, excellent. So things are looking good. Uh, Brown Army is making their way ever so slowly to that front. Um, they're taking the railroads, so hopefully they'll be there soon. Um, what happened here? Did I not get those troops cut off? I don't know what happened. I might have, I might not have. It looks like there's only one division there. Uh, so let's work on getting troops cut off. Let's go this way. And hopefully you'll get that division completely cut off from supply. Uh, it looks like the um, troops this way are, are just taking too long to catch up. So let's go ahead and have them take the railroads over there. Uh, I know that it's going to reduce their organization, but they're never going to get into the conflict otherwise. And you can definitely tell that those tanks are moving way too far ahead of their infantry right now. Uh, the Yellow Army has held that down pretty well, which is good to see. I uh, haven't seen much movement over here, but I'm seeing more troops coming. So that's bad. Uh, just kind of swing on over here. Man, this shit is laggy as fuck, man. 
Um, we'll just see what's what's going on over here. All right, so we did get these troops cut off. That has caused some issues with our, our line. Um, hmm. There's another point right here where we can cut troops off. All right, what I'm going to do, let's just see here. We're going to leave these three troops here. These guys are all cut off. Let's let them uh, just slowly lose their uh, organization and strength uh, from attrition. And maybe our allies will help kind of destroy some of these guys. Uh, and then what we're going to do is we're going to focus on getting these ones cut off as well. I know this is, we're cutting off a lot of troops and we can't really do anything with it, but it, it's fine, guys. Um, the way we're going to do this, we're going to have this guy come over this way because I see that there's a Soviet division here that can hold that province. And let's attempt, this guy here is pretty weak. Let's just let him leave anyway because he's he's so, it, it doesn't matter. Let's let him leave. So he'll go over that way. They're trying to take that province. Looks like they did. Uh, let's attempt to attack here and see if we get a win. Uh, looks like that's going to be a no. All right, we're going to have to wait. Oops, my bad. We're going to have to wait until this guy here uh, gets here. Oh, well, maybe not. Looks like he's going to win now. Maybe. I don't know. Hard to say. Hard to say, guys. So uh, is there anywhere else that we can move? Um, damn, I'd really like to be able to take. Let's, let's attempt to attack here and then have the tank support and see if that's a win. Ugh. Nah, it doesn't look like it's going to be. Are they getting, yeah, I don't know who's getting yeah, air support. Uh, it looks like we failed on that attack. Well, that's unfortunate. All right, um, anything else that we can do over here? Uh, yeah, we're just gonna have to wait. Gotta take our time, guys. Gonna have to take our time. Uh, let's see if we can uh, get this, well, no. Yeah, not gonna be able to make any more movement, guys. We're gonna have to wait. Gonna have to wait. Not gonna be able to do anything else. Let's just let things kind of develop over there. Uh, we're getting the orange army over here, uh, so that's going to be helpful. Um, checking out this uh, location here, and yeah, the lag is bad, uh, extremely bad. Um, and you know, as we we kind of knew that was going to happen. Um, yeah, it's it's unfortunate, but it's it's not unexpected. Uh, come on, get over here, guys, quickly, 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 quickly. I want to I want to cut these divisions off. Let's see if we can make it happen. Um, it looks like they're all retreating, so probably not. Let's attack there. Just uh, It looks like we're going to win anyways, so it doesn't matter. Uh, but yeah, we're slowly pushing across North Africa, getting it all into our hands. Uh, this is probably not giving us any resources, I don't think. Mm, well, we got a little bit of oil there. All right, but oil's not really what we needed. That eight rubber did help, though. Um, so yeah, we're getting a little bit of resources. Let me see if there's anything else here that's going to help us. Got some steel. That'll be helpful. Because um, yeah, oh, nice. That, that area is going to be very good. We got rubber and steel there. All right, just singing more more steel. Okay, got an ace pilot. Lovely. Um, so yeah, these are all going to be uh, taking all this. This area is is going to help us out on the resource situation, which is desperately needed. Uh, we need more resources. And yeah, our troops are taking so fucking long to get over there. Let's have them take the railroads. Railroad over here, guys. All right. Uh, let me see. Uh, the orange army is in place yet. They are in place to kind of stop troops from marching. Let's go ahead and come over here, see if we can beat those guys. Although we could easily cut them off. Well, that's a port, never mind. No point on doing that. Let's just cut them off this way. That makes far more sense. Yep, they have overextended themselves and they are going to pay for it. Yes, sir. Mm hmm. They do not have enough divisions to cover all this territory, guys. I'll tell you that right now. Nope. They did not. This is going to be an important front, though. Uh, as you can see, the allies are pumping a ton of divisions over here. Um, oh, well, maybe not. I guess all these guys are um, from Yemen. Yeah, never mind. I take that back. They're not pumping a ton of divisions over here. These are all Yemen divisions, which is, this is the theater that's important to them. Let's see if we can get those guys cut off. We'll just have to see. Who dares win? All right, those tanks are coming through here. It is so laggy, guys. Um, it's unfortunate. Uh, let's swing on over here to Asia. Uh, but we knew that was going to happen. The later in the game you get, you know, the more lag you end up seeing, unfortunately. Um, so... It is what it is. Uh, can we advance anywhere across here just to cut these troops off here uh, so we can wrap them up? Maybe if we attack here and then uh, support with these guys, perhaps? Maybe. It looks like it's green. We'll see if we can get a win there. Uh, also, we yeah we failed there. We already knew that. Okay. Um, hmm. Yeah, because I'd love to be able to get over here to get to Shanghai. Let's try and attack again, this time support with these troops, and see if that will stay green. I don't know. We'll just have to see, guys. We'll see how it develops. Um, still winning over here. That's good to see. All right. That'll cut off these troops here, and then we can get them wrapped up. Um, swinging on back over to the orange front. Uh, the, oh, nice. Uh, and the fall of Leningrad. Whoa, 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 whoa. That is a significant development. Um, look at this, man. This front has become a disaster for the Soviets. 
Soviets are having a lot of trouble. Uh, we really need to get some of these fronts wrapped up so that they can hopefully, you know, they don't have to man it anymore. Let me just take a look at what the French situation is. They're 97% towards capitulation. Um, damn, man. And we're having so much difficulty decreasing the size of the front because there's so many troops here. And all these are, a lot of these are probably British, which means that we're going to have to still fight them, though they will be cut off, so there will be that. See, like, all these places you could attack from, that's the one you decide to do it? Come back. I don't, well, they're winning. Whatever. We'll help out and get that to be a win quicker. Um, yeah, it's just it's just ugly as hell, man, uh, the way they did this. All right, well, that's the AI. You let the AI control your troops. They're going to do stupid things. Uh, we're going to send the mountain troops into here, uh, and then we're going to have these guys support that, try and take Cherbourg. That is worth some victory points, 15 victory points. That'll be enough probably to force capitulation on France. Uh, we'll have to fight their troops at the very least. Uh, let's go ahead and swing on over to Africa and see how things are going here. Um, they're going well. Okay, very well. Let's go ahead and give them another front, uh, another offensive line, excuse me. Uh, just come across here uh, and execute. Execute it, my friends. Uh, we're going to have a tank unit like fly on up over across the coastline here to try and get these uh, provinces. Okay, uh, let's swing on back over to the purple front. We did cut these divisions off. Excellent. Uh, all these guys are cut off too. Um, though it doesn't look like our allies are helping us much on getting it destroyed, unfortunately. Uh, but let's go ahead and we'll do the work here uh, if we have to. Looks like that's the only option for us. We got to do all the work. Um, not surprising. Uh, that's just the way the AI is. All right, let's go and attack there. Um, these guys are all cut off, so I'm going to go ahead and just launch attacks all the way across. Uh, they're not going to be able to re you know, recover their strength. So even though we might be expending ourselves a little bit, I think it's okay. Um, we could also attack here, which I'm going to go ahead and do, even though it looks like it's going to cause some issues here. Uh, I'm okay with that, guys. I'm okay. Let's go ahead and bring the front back, like so. So this guy can come over here and uh, cover this for us. So yeah, he's gonna come. I think we're just gonna beeline towards Shanghai here. Uh, try and get that division cut off. Uh, might also get our own troops cut off. I don't know. We'll see. I'm not too worried about it. It's fine, guys. We need to get that air base like really bad. Uh, we are not getting a lot of air support, unfortunately. Um, so that really sucks. It looks like we did lose here. Um, damn. All right, that's a problem. Hmm, because that's gonna reconnect these troops to supply. Well, how are we gonna fix that? It doesn't seem like there's anybody there. So let's say I want to get here. How long will that take? One day in 16 hours. When does he get there? One day in 13 hours. Okay, that's that's a problem. Hmm. Maybe we can cut them off right here and get them destroyed. I don't know if that'll be... Yeah, I might not have enough time to do that. Uh, let's bring this guy over here, and then he's going to come this way. Uh, we'll just see if we can make that happen, guys. Um, and then, yeah, they're trying to reconnect right here as well. They're definitely trying to make some movements to reconnect their troops. So let's do whatever we can to make sure that that doesn't happen, because um, I want to get those guys destroyed. Let's take a look at this front here and see how things are going. Uh, not going at all, so let's go ahead and have those guys come this way. Uh, and then anybody who's attempting to go over that way needs to come on over here. And let's have the tanks just march through this territory here take all that for me beautiful all right uh let's attack that one right there uh anything else that we can do along this area i'm not too worried about these troops here we'll wait we'll wait to advance this is all mountains so there's really no reason to really try and push into that we're getting the front reduced um and that's what's important uh sunk, sunk another convoy there Okay, got some convoys sinking. Um, just taking a look at our current experience. Looking pretty good, guys. Uh, we'll probably use that air experience here in a little bit. Um, God, the factory situation is shitty. Pretty bad. Okay, uh, what we're going to do, let's get these dockyards assigned first. Uh, seems that we finished up the um, light cruisers. So let's get the light cruiser fours going. I'll put them right under those battleships. They're probably going to get quite a few... Um, or battle cruisers, excuse me. Let's go like so. We still have more dockyards to design, so uh, let's go like. Let me see. This is 6.54 a year. Let's let's do more of those. Yeah, I like that. I like that a lot. That'll work, guys. That does mean that we need to um, change up our resources a little bit. Um, damn. All right. Well, we can get it from Brazil. Trade with them. Uh, I don't know why they still haven't joined. Oh yeah, that's right. I keep saying that. 
Uh, they're not probably not going to join our faction, unfortunately. Just the way it is. What's going over here? Another British convoy sunk. Uh, looks like we lost the attack here. Well, that's unfortunate. Everybody's starting to pull out of there, though, so maybe we'll be able to make something happen. We also have made some inroads over here. Um, let's let's go ahead and get these guys attacking. They have, they have plenty of room here. Take some more provinces so we can get France to fucking capitulate because I'm tired of fighting these guys. Tired of... Uh, we got to reduce this front, and it's taking up a lot of Soviet troops that they could be using on other fronts. The Soviets are losing. Um, they are having some issues, like serious, serious issues, guys. Uh, let's go this way. See if we can win there. Looks like that should be a win. All right, excellent. Maybe we'll be able to get them to back up into that province so we can get them destroyed. Because uh, these are British troops. We don't want them to evacuate uh, if we can avoid it. And France has capitulated. Wow, great news, guys. They didn't have a lot of stuff because remember they've already capitulated once. Situation is going to be a bit ugly here uh, because of the um, because of all the British troops. Let's go and have all these guys assigned here and just attack in these areas. See if we can get these these troops wiped out. Come on through here, guys. Um, these guys can come over here, and you guys will go over this way. All right, looking good. Um, gonna have to go and take that too. Uh, currently winning over here. Let's see if there's anywhere else we can attack. Uh, let, nope, nope, don't need to attack that way. We're gonna attack this way here. Got these guys going over there, looking good. Okay, yeah, this is all looking good. All right, we'll just let them do their thing for a little bit here. Actually, you guys are gonna go this way. All right, so um, should be able to get all France uh, wrapped up soon. Uh, just taking a look at the clock. We are halfway through the episode because, you know, remember we do have that Really long episode today, guys. Uh, we're gonna do a nice long episode. I don't know where all, hmm, who all did, oh wow, all the troops are assigned over here, but that's unfortunate. Come on over this way, guys. Um, you know, a whole orange army needs to be assigned to here with the exception of that guy. Everybody should be over there. Yeah, that got all fucked up. Okay, well, whatever. It's not surprising, <laughs> not surprising at all. Um, so Iran got this territory for some reason. All right, because they have a claim on it. All right, I suppose that makes sense. We're gonna get all this wrapped up over here, uh, and yeah, this is, all these troops over here are gonna be. I'm gonna take the railroads. Take the railroads. Uh, then we're gonna have these guys manually move to take some of this territory. Let's go that way instead. And you guys go over here. All right, lovely. Let's go and bring these tanks over this way as well. Let's see if we can get them moving through that territory too. And yeah, looking good. Uh, should be able to get this front wrapped up soon. Let's take a look at the African front, uh, North Africa front, and see how things are going here. Uh, let's go ahead and have these guys moving forward. Um, you guys are gonna take all this territory here. All right, looking good. Probably too many troops going that way. Yes, sir, there always is. Always is. Let's go and bring these guys this way. Um, and you guys can attack over here. Just kind of take some of this uh, territory here in the south. A lot of provinces you got to take over here, but all this is going to be very helpful, getting us a lot of resources and stuff. Um, so yeah, I'm liking that. Uh, got more military factories and dockyards in our conquest, and a lot of this is going to us, which is also very nice. Um, it's not going to Soviets. Uh, you know, they got all of France in their hands. I wonder if they'll give us any territory now that they have all of France. We'll just have to take a look here. Uh, how are we doing on infantry equipment? I know that we're using a lot of it. Oh, wow. Infantry equipment's in a shitty position right now, guys. <sighs> I think what we need to do is reduce the amount that are currently converting, I think. Yeah, we could reduce this and then just build another infantry line because the infantry equipment situation is bad. It's like really bad, man. I'm surprised just how bad things are. Let's go ahead and pull these and put them into this one. Uh, we have some dockyards too. Let's go ahead and get them a sign. Uh, they can go into, let me just take a look here. We're gonna put them into the uh, destroyers. We need to get more destroyers. We don't have a lot of those. Uh, that looks good guys doing good on convoys too. So I'm not too worried about that uh, Let's swing on over here and take a look at how things are going on the Asian front uh, These guys are slowly as you can see losing their strength um, Very good to see. I don't know why these guys pulled off from here uh, Really weird, but whatever maybe something happened. I didn't see I missed perhaps um, What we're gonna do We got that guy going there. We need to further destroy these troops here. Let's attempt to launch some attacks here um, Yeah, well, who's yeah, I don't know what's going on here. We only have five divisions assigned to this. Let's do them assigned and them assigned. Just so we can get this wrapped up sooner. Um, let's also assist right here. I don't know if that's going to work. Nope, didn't work. All right, let's launch the attack there. And then we'll support with these guys. 
Remember, they can. I mean, every attack we do, even if it fails, is, is okay. Um, it's fine. Uh, let's see if there's anything else we can do here. We got these tanks. Uh, they should be able to go, and go over here and take Shanghai. Uh, fantastic. All right, let's go ahead and bring... Damn it. I thought I had these guys selected. Bring these guys over here. Uh, we could just launch attacks over this way. Yeah, I think we're going to do that to further widen the front a bit. Uh, we should get Shanghai in our hands momentarily, and then we'll be able to get these uh, this Japanese division here destroyed. It sucks that we had to conquer all of China. I'm, I'm not happy about that. That was not what I wanted that's not my choice um i would have preferred to just build a launch because it's pointless um it's really not that important conquering all china uh, i wish we could have just launched the invasion of, of japan but we just couldn't guys we didn't have we didn't have the numbers uh, of our navy i mean look at our navy guys it's it's just not strong enough to defeat the japanese navy and uh yeah we we failed in our invasion there it looks like they lost some convoys that's unfortunate raider patrols all right um got that let's go I think we should continue improving our navy. Yeah, that'd probably be the best bet. Let's go and get this. This will help out our battle cruisers. Uh, we're gonna grab that up and unfilled import request. What is it? Let's take a look. Um, it's rubber. We're not getting all the rubber from Brazil, unfortunately. All right. Well, let's just take this down. They don't. Yeah, they don't seem to have all the rubber they used to have. Well, that's unfortunate. We're only losing two rubber though. I'm not gonna. I'm not gonna trade for that. Uh, let's go and bring this down. This should give us more factories. Let's take a look at what our factories are doing. Probably nothing. Uh, I guarantee they're, yeah, they're just repairing. All right, well, repairing factories and stuff isn't exactly a bad thing. Um, let's let them repair all that shit that's getting damaged because our, our fucking cavalry can't seem to cover all this, unfortunately. Yeah, we need a lot more cav troops. Okay, whatever. Um, let's see what we can do over here. Get this wrapped up. Let's attack there. These troops look like they should be cut off here. Uh, so we should be able to get this wrapped up soon. Let's go and attack there. Uh, get that finished up. Um, and we're going to attack with these guys. Oops, my bad. These guys as well. Get all these troops destroyed here. Uh, we should have these guys here momentarily. We'll be able to get that province um, taken. Um, all right, go and attack. Attack. All right, so hopefully you should be able to win there. How are things going on this front? Let's uh, attack over here. And where else? Uh, let's just attack with these guys. Um, instead of whatever the hell you're doing, attack right there. Attack, man. These guys are all supplied, unfortunately. Um, I guess come on over here. Yeah, all these guys have supply. Okay, anything else we can, we can attack with these guys here. All right, so should be able to get that wrapped up soon. They are cut off on supply, so they're going to be completely destroyed. Uh, let's bring these guys this way instead, and let's stop with this attack here with the tank. Uh, we'll just let them advance. It's not exactly a bad thing, them taking more provinces and getting further away from their ports. Uh, let's have this guy come take that province, and then everybody needs to come wrap this up, please. Wrap it up. All right, and then these guys are going to come back over to this. All right, all this is looking good. Uh, you guys need to come on over here as well. Looks like they failed on trying to take that port. Let's uh, increase that like so. All right, looking good. I think what we need to do actually is have it increase like this. There we go, looking good. Um, so uh, we'll also have to come wrap that up, but let's finish up over here first. Um, and I don't know, maybe that, I think that tank unit should be able to do it. Yeah, it looks like he did it. He did the trick, he got it done. Let's take a look at the orange front. We haven't looked at that in a little while and see how things are going over here. Uh, let's just go ahead and push forward. Uh, let's see if we can come take the capital here and get those guys uh, capitulating. Oops, yeah, that's fine. Uh, and we could probably attack and win there, so let's go ahead and do it. Might as well. Uh, and they did pull back all across here, so let's go ahead and take these uh, locations. Let's conquer them. All right, excellent. Um, so pushing forward, we are auto-saving because we're entering into the month of July now. July, guys, July of 1946. We still haven't wrapped this up, unfortunately. This has been difficult because we don't have the supply. All right, that sucks. Okay, hmm. I wonder if we can get a win here. Maybe. Let's attempt to. Okay, there's nobody there. All right, we're going to take that province. Might as well. Uh, and see how things went over here on getting Shanghai. We did take Shanghai. Awesome. Uh, so let's go ahead and uh, bring this guy over this way. Uh, he might be able to win there. Let's see. Uh, let's just get him here for right now and then see what we can do. We need to get more troops over here. We don't have enough. Uh, to really get the job done, unfortunately. Let's bring these guys over this way. Uh, but we got our, our, our front is so fucking wide, man. It is bad. I think we can go ahead and probably start launching some attacks here. Our guys are not in a good supply situation either. Um, yeah, they're pretty shitty. Damn, things are bad over here. Um, let's go and attack here. We need to get these guys destroyed. Um, but yeah, this is... The supply here is fucking crap. Just garbage supply, guys. Um, 
Let's get these guys going over this way. They're not even doing anything. I don't even know if they're, yeah, they're assigned there. They're just not able to come over here because of the supply situation. They're like, don't do it, dog. Don't bring me over there. There's nothing to eat. We could attack. When are these guys gonna get here? Seven hours. Nah, we can't attack that. All right, let's take a look at the blue army and see how they're doing on their front. They still got a lot of territory to gain. Uh, let's go ahead and let them just continue attacking, though I will go ahead and manually control these guys and have them just be lined up to that uh, victory point there. Um, yep, yes, sir. And then we're gonna have these guys come up over this way. Uh, attempt to get these uh, troops here surrounded, if at all possible. It's gonna have you guys, they just don't attack enough, the AI, when you put them under. I mean, we have them under aggressive and they're still not attacking as rapidly as they should. Um, let's take a look at the French front, see how things are going over here. Um, and we also have some more military factories. I wonder if the Soviets will give us anything. Nope, they're saying no. Not gonna give you shit. Okay, whatever. It's fine. Let's attack over here first. And we're gonna send both these tank units in and see if we can get a win there. Um, we're also defending over here. Um, not sure what these guys are doing, but they're gonna lose. Uh, because, yeah. Yeah, they're gonna lose. They're taking the, uh... The railroad, so it's just not going to work out. Yemen Arab Republic has capitulated. Great news. Got us some more uh, supplies here. Um, lovely. Infantry equipment got built up a bit, which is something that we were hurting on, so I'm glad to see that we got that. Uh, let's take a look at our military factory situation. Where do we want to put these? I kind of feel like we should continue putting into the um, infantry equipment here. Let's take a look. Um, are they not converting from the stockpile no more? Oh, are we done? 286 of weapons, too. That's not a lot. All right, I think we're done with this, guys. What we're gonna do is we're just gonna delete that. Yeah, because they don't. Yeah, they don't need to convert from the stockpile anymore. No and we'll just put these into to here. Um, yeah, it looks good. Let's just build it like so. Yeah, I like that. That'll work. Uh, and then uh, as far as the uh, support equipment, seems like we're putting a little bit too much into that. Let's put into the artillery a bit more though. And let's see what else we need. Are we good on motorized? We're okay on motorized. It's not bad. Uh, light tanks are, man, we are losing a ton of light tanks over here. That's surprising. Hmm. I wonder if we should get another line of those. I almost feel like we should. Uh, but for right now, let's just put this into, let's put this into this right here. Uh, advanced anti-tanks. Uh, seems that we're also short on some resources again. It's always the case. Damn it. All right, we're gonna have to get ripped off here. Nothing to be done about it. Uh, get some more tungsten as well. And some more steel. Oh god, the steel guys. <laughs> the steel is bad. Because uh, we're getting all those factories, uh, not enough resources to support them, unfortunately. Uh, let's go ahead and move our planes. Uh, we're gonna move them over to here and get them uh, helping us out. Let's take a look at situation over here. Um, I believe it's just about done here, isn't it? Yeah, it's just about done. I'm just gonna get rid of these planes here. Um, we're just gonna de delete their air wings. And there's really nowhere else for air wings to go right now either um, because in China we don't have any any uh, um, air bases, unfortunately. And I don't really think we need them here. I think it's probably just a waste putting them over here. We'll have this guy uh, come on over here and then we'll have this tank unit wrap all this territory up. And then we'll be done here, guys. Uh, we'll be done with this front and then the orange army can go... Oh, wow, I didn't really plan for after that front. Uh, we could advance further into Africa. Oh, but Africa is a mess. Who wants to do that? I know I fucking don't. <laughs> I hate going into Africa. There's really no reason to either. Um, I just don't see the point of advancing into Africa. I'd prefer to just shore it up here and, and defend it. Yeah, I don't really want to do that, guys. I mean, yeah, I don't see the point. I prefer to launch naval invasions, which is what we're going to be doing here. The blue army is going to be uh, invading Spain from the south while the red army attacks from the north. But that doesn't give the orange army a job. Now, technically, the blue army is kind of small, so we could send them over there. Could also send these guys over to Asia, but I'm not really liking that idea. Um, I'm not sure what we're going to do with them, guys. Um, I didn't really have an, uh, a job for them, you know, that I would figured out. The Argentina League, or Argentine League, just joined the Axis. Well, that sucks. It's another country we have to fight, although I don't... I don't think they're a major country, so yeah, we don't have to defeat them in order to win this conflict. But yeah, it's, it's still unfortunate uh, that Axis is getting more people. Why are they joining the Axis when everybody in the Axis, without the exception of Japan, is destroyed? I don't, I don't understand that. It doesn't make any sense. Uh, let me just take a look at our plane situation. We need, let me see, okay, fighters, dive bombers, and torpedo bombers. I think we should put more into the torpedo bomber since a lot of these factories are damaged. Um, so let's, yeah, they're all damaged. It doesn't, it doesn't really matter. 
All right, so should have these troops wrapped up here soon. Just taking a look at the conflicts, uh, if you want to see them. Uh, we currently have, um, so our side has lost 551,000, while the <laughs> allies have lost 1.38 million. A lot of that's on the British side, 993,000 for the Brits. That's a lot, guys. Quite a bit. All right, very pleased with that. Uh, we've lost 73,000 men. Uh, as far as war participation, we have 66%. Quite a bit, guys. Uh, over on this side of things, obviously, uh, we still have lost a lot because of all those troops the Soviets lost. Um, but the, the Axis have lost quite a few troops. As you see, Japan's, their numbers are chalking up there, 1.39 million. Uh, they're catching up with Japan, with uh, Germany, excuse me. Now, where are the Italians at? I know I'll probably pass them. I kind of want to see where the Italians... Okay, they lost 914. So really not that much, um, relatively, of course. Obviously, 900,000 is a lot of men, of course. All right, so um, German Reich has called them into the war. Okay, that's not surprising. All right, so let's let's go ahead and get these guys going over to this this front here uh, to invade Spain, and we're gonna give them an order to come take Madrid. I think let's just go like so. All right, looking good. Um, so they'll get over there. They're gonna get their planning bonuses. We might have to train them. I don't know. We might well. There's not really anybody over here. I don't think the, the Spanish have many troops in their homeland. How many troops do they have, period? They have 104 divisions, but I bet they're all over the world. Probably a bunch in Sicily, probably some in Spain. Um, might be some in Sardinia as well. I don't know. Um, hmm. Maybe we should help with this. I kind of feel like we should. Let's grab a few tank units and some mountain divisions to kind of wrap up this. Uh, we will grab, like, a mountain. We'll give them, like, two mountains and, like, an infantry and another tank unit. Where's another tank unit? Another tank unit. And let's have these guys assigned to this front right here. There we go. Come help wrap these guys up, because I don't know how well the Soviets are gonna do it. I'm sure they'll eventually do it, but we don't actually know. Did they ever wrap up the territory that was, no, they didn't. Look at this, got British troops all stretched out. Maybe that's what the Orange Army should do, is come wrap up these provinces here. Um, anywhere else for them to... Hey, well, that's not really worth it, is it? There's really not. I mean, I guess they can come help in India. We need to get rid of some of these fronts. And I think that's what we should have the Orange Army focus on. Is be, because the the Soviets are, are focused on so many fronts that they can't, they can't do anything. Um, they can't win on the fronts they're on. Uh, because they just can't put the numbers. Like, this one's pretty important for them. And they're just not able to, to win over there. So that's, that's a problem. Let's go ahead and put these into... Uh, we're going to do one more into light cruisers. And we have more military factories as well. We're just not getting the resources to support um, all these factories that we're getting. It's really, really uh, frustrating. Um, infantry equipment, I think we should probably still put into that. Damn, we need more artillery too. Man, we were taking some heavy hits with the artillery. A lot of our guns are getting destroyed, unfortunately. All right. Um, and the light tanks as well is also a problem. So... I, I kind of feel like we'll just wait on this and let's just pump into infantry equipment. Let's get that issue fixed first and then we'll focus on those other ones. Uh, let's trade for more steel, guys. More and more steel we have to give away. Uh, and then this orange army, are they done yet? Not yet. Let's let them finish this up here. Um, I believe there's, yeah, there's nowhere for him to retreat to. I think he's just going to get wiped out, overrun, right? Yeah, he should just get overrun here. Get it done, guys. Get it done. Um, how's this front going? Oh, it's not going. <laughs> okay. Uh, let's have... What we're going to do is let's have them assigned like so. And then give them uh, a new objective to... God damn it. I don't want... Everybody else go to there. Uh, this guy can do his own thing for right now. Uh, we'll just have him... Let's give him orders to, to attack, and we'll have him join the front later. Uh, and then we're going to go ahead and have these guys assigned to take all this territory here. And just tell them to execute as well. All right, looking good. And we'll just manually control uh, this to get these this territory taken. And just like so. And come on over here. All right, excellent. So looking good. Uh, might have to tell some of these guys to take railroads. I think we will. Because uh, not enough of them are taking the railroads. So let's go ahead and make sure that they, they get over here. Take the railroads, please. All right, looking good. Uh, North Africa's almost in our hands. Um, just taking a look. Got some more convoy sunk. Another British convoy uh, sunk over there. Did we finish up over here? What's taking so fucking long? There we go. All right, so the Orange Army. Let's see. Uh, what we're going to do with these guys. Um, let's, let's probably have them... I think we're going to have them wrap up this territory here. Um, or wasn't there something else I said I could have them do? I don't remember. 
No, we, we're not at war with either of these guys, so we can't help out there. Where? What are they in? They're still in the Three Brothers faction. We could always join that conflict. Uh, perhaps. I don't know why it won't let me. Are we at war with them? I don't even know. Let me take a look. So we are not at war with Finland, so can't help in that war. I wonder if they'll allow me to join the Finnish one. They would. I think maybe we'll go over to Finland uh, and try and wrap that up with this orange army. Yes, that is what we're, we're gonna do. Um, let's go ahead and move these guys. I suppose they can go to Moscow for right now. Uh, let them train up. Um, yeah, let's let them train in, in Moscow. Um, come on, guys. We'll get them fully trained before we actually throw them into the war and get them all their equipment, all that kind of good stuff. You know what, probably better to just have them train here now that I'm thinking about it. Yeah, train over here, please. Um, because, yeah, they're gonna take more attrition in Moscow than they would here. Also, we gotta supply them over there. So it's better to just have them go there. Uh, and then when they all get there, we'll get them training up. It's gonna be awesome. Oh yes, I've completely neg neglected the Asian front while I've been focusing on, on Europe. Uh, let's try and finish this up. So many issues because of the lack of supply throughout these areas, unfortunately. Uh, we just don't have supply. All right, what about over here? Did we finish this? Um, this guy didn't attack. Let's, does this guy have a port here? He does not. Let's attack there and then come up over this way and try and get this guy destroyed. See if we can anyway. Um, and then we'll, we'll do anything there. Um, that's fine. Let's see if we can get behind these guys. I know this is probably stupid. This is gonna result in me getting cut off, but whatever. <laughs> that's fine. Um, we're gonna have this guy come here. We can have this guy come over here, over to this province, and then take that one. Maybe we can get up around these guys, perhaps? It's a possibility. Let's see. Let's see if we can make it happen. Um, we'll come up around these guys as well. We're gonna attack that way. Hopefully nobody ends up being there. Uh, we are gonna win there, so that's awesome. We did win here as well. These guys are extremely weak, as are we though, so yeah, I mean, it's... Uh, yeah, it sucks. <laughs> All right, these guys are gonna lose here, unfortunately. We will win there, though. Um, yeah, the Asian front is terrible, man. Yeah, we are just not doing good there. Uh, let's let's go ahead and, let me just see here. How many uh, artillery are we losing? 159 to 105. It feels like we should probably get another line of the artillery gone for right now. Is this a situation? Let me just take a look at something else. So modern tanks have their full efficiency, while the artillery does not. Okay, what we'll do, let's do the tanks first because I want to keep the tank unit strong. Uh, so let's do another semi-modern light tanks here and then put them right under here. There we go, gorgeous. All right, and we're gonna put like five factories into that. We don't want the uh, tank situation to get bad. Uh, I wish the Soviets, look at all the strength and stuff they have here. Why don't they attack? Why do I have to do all the fucking work, man? That's what I don't understand. And then I don't get like any participation for it either. Like we've ticked up our participation in this war by like 2% since we've been over here in Asia. Oh wow, um, this is bad. Yeah, that's not good at all. Okay, um, we need to get this wrapped up like stat. Yeah, cause they're about to, uh, let's, let's bring this guy over here. Cause they're gonna get really close to connecting them. Okay, can we do anything else? Um, over here. Let's attempt to just get these guys cut off. I don't know how well that's gonna work out. Uh, and then we're gonna attack here as well and see if we can win there. Um, no, we can't. All right, let's just pull this back. And then we're gonna have, yeah, him go up this way, I think. This is, this is a situation. <laughs> let's pull this back, because it's clearly not gonna work. And we just don't have enough troops over here, man. 15 was not enough. Maybe I should sign. I, I kinda wanna get, okay. We're gonna get the, uh, we'll get them finished up over here in Finland first, and then we'll we'll split the orange army and send some over to that purple army because clearly they don't they don't have enough troops over there to do what we need to do. Um, how is this front going? Uh, let's go ahead and have them attack. Yeah, because there's nobody here. Yeah, there's like nobody here. Let's just go all the way across and see if we can get some troops cut off here. Let's go this way, uh, and you guys are gonna come on over here. And let's just bring the tank units this way. All right, looking good. Uh, we're gonna attempt to just launch yeah, attacks everywhere. Everywhere. Let's go ahead and go this way, take Barcelona, uh, and then get these troops potentially cut off. Um, we'll see what happens when we get over there. Uh, we also need to get this wrapped up, because clearly the, uh, the AI is not doing it, as expected. They never do it. Let's um, increase this and see if we can win in Marseille. Maybe. 
Yeah, it's green right now, but remember we got another division coming over here. If we can get both of these two port provinces destroyed, then these guys will be cut off from supply. Um, can't allow the British to have a little base of operations to continue fighting in France. That is not what I want. Not at all. All right, so they are attacking us there, uh, which is unfortunate. Uh, we're getting another guy over here. I don't know if we're going to be able to hold it. Let's see. We're about hours away. Let's. I got to keep paying attention to the, the Asian situation here because um, it's pretty fucking dire overall. Um, they did win there. Damn, that's unfortunate. Okay, uh, but we might be able to get them cut off. I don't know. If we took that province, they'd be cut off. That's something to consider. Yeah, maybe we'll do that. Let's see if we can win here. Um, nah, we're not going to win here. We'll try. Let's we'll see if we can make it happen. Attack there. And then have all these surrounding troops here, like, supported. Maybe. We really need to get that wrapped up, though. And then this is just, uh, this is ugly, man. Trying to get, these troops have been here. Look at how weak they all are. If the AI would just attack there, we would have it wrapped up already. Uh, but they refuse to. Um, let's attempt to attack here again. Uh, these troops are cut off, so we should be able to get them destroyed. Uh, that'll get us that really important air base that we need. We also got these guys cut off. We've got them uh, cut off. We've got a lot of troops that are currently cut off here. Uh, instead of going all the way over there, let's just stay here for right now. Uh, we already extended this front quite a bit, uh, so let's not extend it any further. Uh, overall, our troops are so overextended um, in Asia. It's it's bad. All right, so those guys are still going up there to train. Um, over here, we're about to get all this wrapped up. Um, and let's see if we can get this guy coming over here to take some more territory. Uh, you guys are both going to go that way, please. Both of you go that way. Um, and whoever's not going <laughs> over there, I want you to go over there. All right, actually, I could have done this easier. Yeah, go that way. And you guys go this way. All right, lovely. Getting all that taken. I uh, should have this wrapped up soon, too, which is why I'm not going to fix it. Um, let's go over there, please. And you guys will be assigned to that one as well. And you guys. Let's just have them take the railroads over here. And you guys can take the railroads over there as well. All right. Fantastico. Anything else that we need to be concerned about? Not really looking pretty good overall all throughout this uh, area here. All right, I, I don't know how well the cavalry units are covering these. It seems like they're not able to cover everything. Oh, well, you know what? I didn't extend them uh, yet, so let's go ahead and do that. Though, like, let me just see here. How many do they need? They need 17 to cover the area. Oops, well, not that one. Uh, so hopefully they should be able to do this uh, with what we have. Oh, God damn it, I keep clicking that. Let's see if this will be enough. Ah, uh, no. They're going to be overstretched. Well, that's unfortunate. Uh, let me just take a look over here. Um... God, I'd like them to at least get this training done uh, before we deployed them. We almost have those Turkish elites done, so that's going to be more to more troops. Uh, we're at 459,000 manpower. Manpower situations, ugh, not great. It's not great, guys. Let's go ahead and push forward over here. Have these guys attack over this way. Get that wrapped up. And you guys can come. Uh, just go right there for right now. Let me see where you're currently assigned. Uh, yeah, that looks good. Let's assign this guy, this guy over here to that province. Uh, so we did take, oh, he failed. Don't pull that back. Stop attacking. You're going to fail. <laughs> it's not going to work. Uh, and then we're going to have these guys come over this way. we got another tank unit going over here. Let's go ahead and see if we can take some more territory. I'm just kind of pushing forward. I know that this is kind of stupid, but it's it's fine. I'm not worried about it. <laughs> I know that this might result in some troops getting cut off. Um, hopefully not. You know, that's what I'm hoping anyway. Let's push forward over here. Uh, we can attack right there, I guess. Sure, why not? All right. Attack, man. All right, so we're taking that there. Although we probably, you know what? Let's pull this back. We can get that guy cut off. Go over that way, please. All right, so uh, have this division cut off. So we'll better get those that Spanish division destroyed. Uh, we're currently only a few minutes away from the episode ending, unfortunately. Ugh, goes even an hour. It goes so quick. It's weird how that happens like that. Let's attack over here, and then let's have uh, these two support that attack. Just uh, the supply, man. It's so bad there. That's a, it's a serious problem. We did get that finished up. That is excellent to see. Um, about fucking time, guys. About fucking time. All right, you guys need to go back here. I don't know what front you're assigned to, but stay there. Um, we don't have anybody assigned to that, so let's go ahead and fix that. Uh, I need you guys over here as well, so come on over here. Need to get them wrapped up. We're going to assign these guys there as well. I, I don't know if this is overkill. We're getting probably overkill. Yeah, let's assign these guys to that one instead. All right, looking good. Um, still attempting to get these guys cut off here. Uh, looks like we might have 
failed in that attempt. Let's let's move to that province. Let's see if we can take that. Get those two divisions cut off. Um, but yeah, overall, it's it's looking better uh, now that we have that wrapped up. Uh, that was kind of a, a problem. Uh, it looks like we failed here. Okay, um, let's go this way, and then have these guys support. Because, uh, yeah, clearly this guy was not up to snuff. He wasn't able to do it. And you guys just... Let's um, reduce this. <laughs> uh, you guys get across the river. At least we can do it without having to fight somebody. Uh, but, yeah, it's, 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 a, it's a situation here. When does China capitulate? We do get the technology sharing. That's nice. Uh, but let's take a look at when China capitulates here. Um, we don't really need more oil at the moment. So we're not going to get that. Um, could get the armor bonus, I suppose. Um, probably might want to do that eventually. Let's take a look at what else we have available to us. Uh, destroyer monitors, light cruiser, heavy cruiser models, those are all, all good. Um, that's naval no doctrine bonus. I, I think because we're still investing pretty heavily in the navy. Let me just take a look here. Alright, that's just the conquer focus, so we don't need that. Um, we already have that. It doesn't give us any other bonus. So, not gonna get that. Yeah, I don't think we're doing anything else over on that branch. Uh, so let's let's instead focus on the stuff over here. Um, I, I th kind of feel like we should just do the navies for right now. Yeah, let's continue with working on the navies, guys. Let's go ahead and get. Let's do this one. All right, awesome. Anything else that we can do over here? Uh, they are attacking there, trying to. Although, yeah, that wouldn't help them much. Let's attack. Um, damn, we're gonna have to wait. Let's see if we can win here. Yeah, probably not. Okay, let's support with these guys. Now that should be a win. Oh, yes, we have our air, uh, airport over here. Let's put all of our planes there. All of them are going to have to go there, guys. Uh, and it looks like we should have the room as well. So, awesome. That's going to be helpful. That's going to be incredibly helpful. Uh, don't we have more? That's three. Okay, this is all we have. All right, it's 400 and 400. So, 800 should be able to, yeah, they should be able to fit there. And that'll give us some air support, uh, finally. Uh, I think we might have been getting some in some of these fights. Um, actually, we need some for over here. Okay, what we're going to do, let me just take a look at the situation here. Okay, so we're going to want to keep two of these guys here and not move them to Shanghai. Let's leave them here and have them support in this area here, I think. Although this is... Hmm. Okay, they can stay supporting here for right now, and then they'll want to move into the northern area uh, as we, you know, advance up here. Because, um, yeah, if we move all of them down here to Shanghai, we won't get any support, and these guys clearly need need support. They're having some issues taking territory there. Um, can we get anything else done here? It looks like we should be able to beat them there, I believe. Let me just take a look here. It's a matter of hours. When are they getting out of there? All right, it's days, so I think, yeah, we're going to get there. Awesome. Let's go and advance forward with these troops as well. Uh, we're going to have these guys come over here. Uh, come over there. I don't know where you're going. Come on over here. How about we should get those ones wrapped up? Excellent. They are wrapped up. Uh, and, yeah, this is looking good, guys. Uh, getting the uh, China front moving forward ever, ever so slowly. It's bad, guys. <laughs> it's so bad and time-consuming, um, this front, because of the supply issues. Um, we've had so many supply issues on this front, uh, unfortunately. Uh, we did get a lot of troops over here cut off. This guy currently is... Let's attack him. Attack! I don't know if that's going to work out. Probably won't. Let's attack over here as well. Uh, we're going to send those guys in too. Uh, and hopefully we can get these guys destroyed. Looks like that one's going to fail, but maybe we can stop him? I don't know. We'll see. Let's go ahead and have this guy come over to this front. Uh, and just come over here. Probably not going to be very effective. I don't think we're able to get them cut off. Uh, let's, let's see. But we are taking that province, so he's... No, if he takes that, he won't be cut off anymore. Never mind. Never mind. All right, let's take a look at the Orange Army. They should over, all be over here now, and we have these guys too. Let's go ahead and throw them into the new training army. We need a new one. Uh, and let's go, like, into peasants here. There we go. And train. And then we'll take the Orange Army, and um, any of the troops in here that aren't trained are going to be going over into the training army. All right, excellent. So they're going to train up. Uh, get us some more army experience as well. We also have more air experience um, that we can spend if we wanted to, but we'll wait. We'll wait till we get a little bit higher. Uh, I completely forgot about the Spanish front. Uh, just so many fronts that we're currently managing. It's it's kind of hard uh, trying to get it get it all done. Let's attack with all these guys. Get this wrapped up over here. Um, as the front uh, decreases in size for the Spanish, they're gonna be able to defend it a little bit easier. Um, so let's let's go over this way. Let's have this guy go here. This guy go here. And you guys go this way. Actually, you guys can go that way, I believe. Or just come on through here. We did take this province. Lovely. Uh, let's go and beeline over towards... No, this is even quicker. Towards Madrid. 
Uh, see if we can get uh, the Spanish to capitulate. And you guys can come over here. Just pushing forward wherever possible. All right, looking good. All right, that's going to be helpful. Uh, the Soviets are just pumping troops over here. I was kind of hoping when we got France finished up that they would bring more troops onto their fronts that they need to focus on, but they are not. They are not. Well, we'll help them over there in the war uh, against the Finnish uh, soon. Soon, guys. All right, just so much lag. It is, is bad. Um, and we are actually done with the episode here what is how's the blue army doing did i ever finish this no they're still attacking um let's let's manually control some of this uh because yeah you can see that they're they're not doing anything never do get behind those guys please and you guys will just come over this way and beeline towards that province there and yeah that looks good all right so let everybody else just kind of just go um and what's going on over here Okay, nothing to be concerned about. So we almost have the entire Mediterranean under our control. Um, this is gonna be excellent. This is really gonna help us out here. Uh, these guys currently attacking, or they should be attacking here. It looks like they decided not to. Go ahead and finish that up, or they lost here, I think, is what happened. All right, those guys, those guys should be able to wrap that up. Tank unit, come on over here. Um, and let's attempt to cut these troops off. We'll see if we can. Have these guys take this, uh, these provinces here. Uh, and then this tank unit here can just close this up, please. And we need to move. We don't, we're not getting any air support over here, I just realized. Okay, so we're probably going to want to fix that situation. So we'll do that now. Um, just bring some of these planes over here. Uh, let's see. I know that I have quite a few assigned. What we're going to do, um, how many can we fit in these areas? Really can't fit any. Okay, so it doesn't really matter because we can't fit any. We can fit, like, a little bit. <laughs> what we could do here... Uh, let's take um, one fighter wing and put him over here, assign him in there, and then we'll take uh, the dive bomber wing and put him over here, and he'll be able to help. Until we get that other uh, base there, we're not going to be able to do much. Uh, let's go ahead and just get rid of this fighter wing, though. don't really need him over here at the moment. And then we'll also get one of these guys uh, removed. This dive bomber can be removed. All right, excellent. We'll slowly get troops going down there. Um as we're able to um so hopefully yeah i can see the british probably launching a lot of invasions how many troops do they have left they got a lot they have a lot of troops how are they doing on manpower over here uh they're on all adult serve um and they have two point something million manpower so they got a lot we're not going to get that uh we're not going to be able to win that way that's not how we're going to win this war all right so we got some troops finished up training uh let's just take a look at the uh, asian front again uh this beautiful beautiful front of ours <laughs> that is just so great uh, I love it. Um, let's see if we can wipe these guys out. Probably not. And we're going to support with these ones. No. That is a lot of divisions. They're not going to be able to do it. Let's just going to pull it back. Alright, what we need to do is assign another guy over here. But yeah, the supply is what's fucking us up and what's going to make it so difficult to get those guys uh, wrapped up over there. So we did finish up here. Awesome. Let's go and take that. Uh, let's get these guys assigned. Uh, and you guys are clearly already assigned somewhere so let's let them continue doing what they're doing um yeah looking good over here we could cut some more divisions off but yeah we can't even do anything about it once we do cut divisions off so uh let's reduce this here hopefully they don't i don't think they're able to attack us though uh, let's have these guys attack here and see if they can win uh, looks like yeah they don't have any supply we might be able to beat anybody now yep we're at a point where we can just beat anybody all right let's go ahead and have both these guys attack over that way then yeah they have completely lost all their their organization so we should be able to get all these guys wrapped up um hopefully pretty quickly here uh so that's awesome that's a lot of japanese troops here that are going to be destroyed a lot of them guys um let me just take a look at the the china situation as well i'm going to see how that's this war i want to see how long until china capitulates um they are currently 97 percent towards capitulation so very soon guys very very soon all right and i don't even know if well, well we'll we'll keep our planes up there in the north might as well might as well. Uh, yeah, we're going to get that wrapped up. Looking good. Let's go and swing on over to the um, training guys. And, yes, we do have some some of them done. Let's go and throw them into there. Uh, swing on over to the Blue Army and see how they're doing. Uh, they're having some issues here. Um, why don't you stop doing whatever that is you're doing? Uh, and we're going to sign all these guys to this front here. Um, and we're going to reduce the size of the front as well. We're just going to put it over on this side. I don't really want them getting river penalties and shit. And then we'll wipe them out. Um, and then we're just going to have this guy beeline over to here. Uh, and we'll stop this guy from whatever it was he was doing. And attack, man. Attack all the way across here, please. 
All right, looking good on that blue front. Let's swing on back over to Spain, see how things are going. Um, we're wrapping up that area there. Looking good. This is now wrapped up as well, so let's go ahead and throw these guys onto this front. Hopefully, they'll get moving over there soon. Uh, some of them are saying, I can't do it. I got supply problems, buddy. It's okay. I think you can handle it. Uh, we've got more room for planes. Let's go ahead and get the, the planes over here assisting us. Uh, move these guys over to here, and I think that should be... That's 400. Um... Can we put more over here? I believe we should be able to. Let's go ahead and do that. Let's bring one more dive bomber to support and the other fighter. Seems that we're actually having trouble over here. Yeah, like there's too many enemy planes right now. Right, can we do anything else over here? Let's get behind these guys so we can... Well, I mean, it's not really destroying them. Um, we won't be able to wipe them out, but yeah, we're going to do that. Let's go this way uh, and then have you guys... Uh, no, we're not going to be able to go that way. Come over here. All right, excellent. Looking good all across there. Uh, anywhere else that we can make a little bit of movement here. Uh, Spain should hopefully capitulate soon. Um, I don't know. It looks like we need to take more victory points, I suppose. All right, we'll... No, stay in Madrid. Stay there in Madrid for right now. Uh, and then have these guys tack over that way. All right, excellent. Looking good all across this area. About to get these guys cut off, too. Um, so that looks good. Let's swing on back over to the Asian front and see how things are going over here. Um, we're going pretty good right there. Um, still wrapping this up here. Uh, God, we're going to have some difficulty taking them out. I can tell you that right now. Um, could, of course, beeline over here to try and get them to capitulate. How many victory points is that? That's not worth shit. No, there's no point on doing that. Uh, it looks like they, the Japanese and the Chinese are having some difficulties manning this entire frontier. It's too wide for them, and they've lost a lot of troops to, towards us cutting them off and whatnot. Uh, so, yeah, they're having quite a bit of difficulty dealing with this. Um, clearly, we still don't have enough troops over here just yet. We need to get, like, five divisions. Maybe that'll be enough. I don't know. All of our divisions are extremely weak, so it's, it's hard to say, guys. It really is. Let's go and pump through over to here. See if we can uh, take some territory there. Go up this way as well. Maybe we can get that other division cut off there. Uh, currently still advancing over there. Uh, let's see if any of these guys are done. No, they're not. And I believe we're about... Yeah, we're going to have to end the episode here. Oh, I completely forgot about this situation, too. Once again, guys, too many fronts going. <laughs> too many fronts. Let's go and support with them. Uh, and we can go ahead and attack here to make sure that they don't, uh, they don't go there. Um, so, yeah, maybe we can get that wrapped up. And nice. Yeah, that is looking good. All right, so we should have that. We'll have them bottled up over here. And let's just go and pull back from here. And then we'll be able to get them destroyed, uh, these troops here. Uh, let's go and attack. Oh, we got a little bit of a little bit of lag there. Oh, no, we went into August. Oh, all right. Well, we are in August now. That's excellent. Let's go and attack here and get these guys destroyed. Uh, we're going to reduce the size of this front just a little bit, just like so. Uh, there's no reason to be on that side of the river. And then we'll attack this way. Uh, we'll have these guys, um, let these guys come up over here. Take this territory, go to Valencia. That should be enough to get them capitulate. Not entirely sure. I guess we'll just have to see. Um, but hopefully that'll be enough. And we did get these guys surrounded, so let's go ahead and destroy them. That should be pretty easy. These guys are surrounded as well, so uh, let's go ahead and get this territory taken here. Um, and I, I don't know. Let's see if we can win there. Looks like we can. Awesome. Um, so looking good all across this front. Spain is... Let me just take a look. Where is uh, Spain at uh, for capitulating? 75%. Okay, good. Very good. All right, so everything's looking pretty good over here. Uh, I guess we're going to go ahead and end the episode, guys. I've, I've said it long enough. It's been a pretty pretty long episode. This is going to take a long time to get this all done. Like I said, it's going to be coming out, oh, early morning on Sunday or something like that. Um, let me just kind of see if there's... There's really not... We haven't really been doing much over here. Uh, I did bomb the Japanese fleet. It seems like the Japanese fleet is... They might be even stuck over here. I'm not entirely sure. We, I think so. Yeah, I think they're stuck. That's awesome. Um, we did lose some convoys there. That's really unfortunate. Hopefully that wasn't any troops. I don't know. Could have been. Could have been some, uh... No, it wasn't cavalry. I don't know. Uh, we probably need to get our fleet going out here. Although... Hmm. I don't know. Do you think our fleet is ready, guys? That's the question of the day. Do you think our fleet is ready to go out there? 22 ships. Do you think they can handle whatever the Axis and the Allies have in the Mediterranean? I don't know. It's, it's, a, that's a difficult question. There's, they have a lot. Um, so I really can say, let's come over here and get this wrapped up, and then we'll come back and, and attack that, uh, and have all these guys, oh, they're already working. Okay. Um, all right, we're going to fail here. I don't really want you guys attacking that way. Attack this way instead. And yeah, we're getting more troops as well, so that's fine. Um, it is fine, guys. So yeah, I'd love to hear in the comments if you think that this was the better way to do this, uh, doing the, the longer episode uh, for the weekend when I can't can't do two, um, you know, or I can't get them out early enough, um, or would you have preferred me to put it out uh, late Saturday night and late Sunday night? 
Um, yeah, I'd love to hear you guys' opinion. I think overall you ended up getting longer, longer content here, and you got it all sooner. So in my opinion, I think this is probably the better way to have done it. Looks like the British are gaining territory in Italy, so that's unfortunate. God, the fucking Soviets, man, they just fell in miserably. I'm just taking a look at their numbers. They're still good on manpower. I bet it's equipment that they, they can't sustain. Um, but yeah, let's go ahead and end it here. Make sure you leave that like, subscribe to the channel, and thanks for watching, guys.